Okay, so let's fire this up and um, see what we get for the day, for this morning. One dash, see what comes up. First is $6, McDonald's, 1.8 miles. Yep, we're gonna take that. It's not going far. The McDon Most of the drive is to McDonald's, so it's not going far from McDonald's, which is good. I am on my way to work. This is in the general direction of where I work, so we'll take this and then we'll be done with our dash for the day. Normally, I don't get a good offer like this right off the bat, so really pleased with that. It will be interesting to see if it's ready when I get there. I unfortunately don't have an insulated bag with me, but I have my heated seat on. So that should help keep the food warm. And like I said, it's not going very far, so. We should be in good shape. Heat's on in the car. It's not cold in the car. It's cold outside, but for the most part. I don't generally recommend dashing without an insulated bag. If this were going farther, more miles, I think it would be a problem, but in this instance, I don't think so. Two-thirds of the distance in this trip is going to McDonald's, so. Now, this particular location can be a little slow. Sometimes their lobby is closed for whatever reason. But we'll work with what we got. Hey folks, just wanted to jump in here real quick. I had some issues with my dash cam. I arrived at McDonald's. It took about seven minutes to get the order. Um, I mean, they didn't even acknowledge me. No one even turned around and said anything until they had the order ready and then they were kind of assumed I was the person picking it up. So probably not the best situation there. All right, so we'll continue on with this and then we'll wrap things up. Text one outside, our buzz, good, good communication, nice. We like that. Prefer to have a door code, but you have to settle with you got right okay so our dash is done and we were out for about 18 minutes we made what six dollars in 18 minutes and the mileage was low it's two miles this is we were looking at three dollars a mile and we drove yeah like i said two miles so that's it for this dash of the day, and we'll get together next time and show another one. All right, bye. So one thing I forgot to mention, this is John from the future, or I guess your past. Anyway, one thing that I forgot to mention was that, so the person had texted me and asked me to text them to buzz them in. <laughs> And so I texted them, said I was there, and I waited, and I waited, and I waited, and I waited. Finally, someone came out the door of the apartment complex, so I, I got in to do the delivery. I got in the elevator, went up to the fifth floor where the person's, uh, well, I was in the elevator when he texted me back and said, okay, I'm buzzing you in. Doors opened up, I delivered his food, and, uh, and then kind of got out of there, you know. Uh, I was almost to the point, I was getting to the point where I was probably going to leave it at the front door at this point. Uh, I think I waited two or three minutes. It's happened in the past that when I've gone to this particular apartment complex, there have been people there who have been guests and they don't know how to use the intercom system and buzz people in and stuff like that. So, so there's that. Anyway. Uh, I hope you, again, I hope you enjoyed this uh, dash of the day. 
and we'll see you next time.